temperatures are right now mid to upper 40s. We will see increasing clouds around 11 a.m. And I think it's beyond 11 a.m. Our better chances line up for seeing a couple of showers move through the valley floor. And then beyond 3 p.m., we should start to see our skies clearing out a bit more. And even by 9 o'clock tonight, we're clear and dry temperatures in the upper 40s at that point. So I expect those showers to arrive by midday to early afternoon. It's also going to return more snow to the mountains. Today is going to be in general breezy and a little bit cooler. And then checking in on this view as we look across the Tahoe planner. This one coming from Heavenly Resort. A lot of the resorts right now reporting anywhere between about six to well 15 inches of snow up at the summit there at Palisades. So a wide range for the mountains. And if you are traveling there to do some skiing or some riding, the wind is going to be around through much of the day and that's going to kind of create a bit of a wind chill factor. So while the highs are in the mid 30s, it'll feel more like they're down in the upper 20s. So make sure you dress in those layers if you're going to be heading out to the mountains and prepare for some more snow, some freshies out there in the mountains, especially beyond three o'clock. We'll get a couple more inches at some of those higher passes. Uh, looking ahead at things, this is noontime. Showers over Sacramento, Fairfield as well, and up through Yuba City. And the snow's coming down there along parts of the northern Sierra, especially around Plumas County. And then more of that snow starts to come down between 3 and 6 p.m. So keep in mind, if you're trying to plan travel to the mountains, you're probably going to need to chain up if you don't have four-wheel drive sometime later today and into the evening. It's 814 right now. Brian's got you covered planning a drive currently. Yeah, and we'll take a look at Interstate 80 right now where they're still holding traffic in Colfax. This should change very soon as they have cleaned up what was an overturned big rig on eastbound Interstate 80 right around the Gold Run area. That all happened at 445 in the morning, but for the time being, they are still diverting traffic off as they make the final touches to the freeway there after there was a fuel spill and they had to clean up all that diesel and mix with the water on the roadway there. So you can see all the purples indicated on that eastbound side. Westbound still getting through, but we do have chain controls in the Sierra 80, 50 and 88. So be ready for that. Not only now, but with more showers on the way, as you heard Tamara say. 50 a little slow right now coming through Watt Avenue. We've got a number of incidents on the surface street, so just be careful with the damp roads out there. The leaves that are on the road make some pretty slick conditions there. The freeways, though, here in the Sacramento area, no major problem.